Hello and welcome to Solution Code. In this video, we'll see about the Query Builder class in CodeIgniter. What are the benefits of using Qu Query Builder class and how to use it? So, in our last video, we have wrote a code where we have fetched the data from our uh, table users and showed it in the view. If you see the code, we have created a controller named user underscore details and this controller loads the model, user model, which is inside the models folder under the name user underscore model and in that we have a function named written users, which has written all the users from the users table. So if you see this, this is a normal query of my SQL. Now in this video we are going to learn about the query builder class. So what is the need uh, and why should we learn about the query builder class if we can write query in the normal language. So firstly by using the inbuilt classes of uh, CodeIgniter we have to write less code instead of writing the entire query now this is a simple query so you can consider it like uh, it's a small query so why not to write in a query function directly but there are certain cases where you have to uh, you have to specify the joins where conditions and a lot of things so in that case your query becomes huge so it's better if you use the inbuilt query builder classes to generate the query for you now if you see this dollar this DV query select star from this uh, table which is user so instead of writing this I can also write as I have already loaded my database table so I can use dollar DB get method and here I have to specify the user table name so this is my table name user and this is my get method so this would produce a query select star from the table name which is users so instead of writing the entire query I have just written dollar this get and the table name and it would automatically generate the query for me now what are the benefits of using query builder classes instead of the normal methods where we write the query so firstly if you go in your database dot php you can see there is a db driver now currently we have mysqli as a default driver so it ex uh, accepts only mysql statements here now what if i change the driver to something else because codeigniter supports multiple databases now if suppose i have a big project and unfortunately i need to change the database from mysql to suppose ibase or something else sql lite or uh, ibase etc etc I have to do that so I have to just make the changes here and I'll write the name as ibase or anything what I have to do now instead of <coughs> using the query builder class if we use the normal methods where we have to write the query then this is a mysql query as we all know and if I want to change the database this happens uh, in a very less cases but it happens so whenever it happens you have to just make the change only in one place which is your database.php with the driver name and the user details of that table or uh, that database <coughs> so if you are using the normal query you have to make the changes in your entire project wherever you have specified the query so this is a very important uh, 
use of using the query builder instead of using the normal queries okay so if you go to the documentation of query builder by the way if you have downloaded entire codeigniter from the website they also have a user guide folder so you can access it directly with a slash user guide if you have not deleted it query builder now this is a query builder class and let me remove the highlighted areas from here yes so this is a query builder class and it has lots of inbuilt methods which we can use to generate almost every query which we normally write and suppose I want I was selecting a data so we have used this query dollar this TV get so this is like it will generate a query like select star from my table which is a table name also you can specify the limit uh, which is the second and the third parameter so dollar this db get the table name and the limit and this is offset similarly you can also write the where statement so suppose I want to write a where statement here so I can write it like dollar this db where and specify my where here like suppose I want specifying like ID is one so this will generate a query which is select star from users user where ID is equal to one so this is the way to write this also coordinator gives us a method which is a get where which has together everything so instead of writing it in two lines we can also write this in dollar query is equal to dollar this db get underscore where and get from which table users table where you can specify the array and here it would be the ID of one and if you have some other conditions you can also specify that thing here right okay so this would give me a single result so you can see that we have wrote a less amount of code and this has produced a query which is same as select star from the table user where ID equals one okay now if I change the ID to two you can see that the results keep changing so there are many of many such classes you can use dollar this select method select maximum of age and stuff like that you can use joins and lots of things and this is the whole documentation where you can find each and every methods explained in a quite sim uh, simple manner so if you are stuck somewhere or you don't understand any of the methods and you want an explanation just uh, comment below with your queries and I would solve them so this is the way 
the queries are made using a query builder method also one more important thing about this query builder class is it also prevents a database from injections because each and every query has been escaped so no more database injection would occur in this class by using this class thank you for watching guys if you have any doubts in this video please feel free to comment below thank you